Hello again everybody. I am here to introduce our new book uh, edited just today dealing with a building in Rome Villino Triunfale by an engineer Ugo Lucicenti and this book is interesting because it, um, in, it studies the architecture in Rome in the, in the 50s and made any in interesting comparisons among Luigi Moretti and Lucicenti the same whose work was um, was uh, characterized by the work on the facade this is uh, Lucicenti's building this is a very famous uh, Moretti building this is another important Moretti building the common, the common part of the work of these two um, architects um, is in the uh, ability to detach the facade from the other part of the plan. And um, the author of the book <coughs> uh, speaks as about uh, the uh, engineer, the Società Generale Immobiliare, the client, and about the history and the construction and the project of this building. These are some other works of the same engineer. And who is very famous for having planned also an important building in Rome uh, an, a hotel, uh, the Hilton Hotel, who was um, criticized by all, all the other architects in Rome. But um, Lucicenti was also able to, to plan something like this, a very strange house in Rome, single house in Rome, with a strange roof, very, very particular. In the second part of the, of the book, um, the author explains us the position of the building and, the, and its composition, its variations with wonderful new design of this building. Very, very uh, important but not well known to most of the architects. Uh, the second part of the book, as you know, is um, made of drawings, original drawings made by the association and the author of this building with some readings of its geometries and proportions and axonometrical views, perspectives and in the last part of the book you can see also this, the first version of this of this uh, uh, building, the version of 1954, was uh, quite different from the one uh, Lucicanti uh, in the end built. In the end of the book, you can find, as usual, a part dedicated to the images and the books dealing with this argument. Of course, languages, Italian and English. English is uh, not in the end of the book, but is inside the book with some dedicated pages, full text in English. The price is very affordable, as, as usual. Okay, well, thank you very much, and see you soon. Mm -hmm.